Hey guys, and, uh, ladies, um, hello ladies, um, <laughs> so, chest voice, let's get into it, quick, alright, yes, I moved, because it was way too loud over there, so, chest voice, this is by far the easiest register to find because you probably already use it all the time in your everyday speaking voice. So to verify that you do, um, go ahead and take your hand and you're going to put it on your chest right here. Right here. There we go. Ooh, wow, I'm an angel. <laughs> um, anyways, so uh, right here on your chest, not too high, not too low because you ain't going to feel anything. Well, actually, well, you might feel something down there. But no, you're going to put it right here, uh, right on your sternum. And just go ahead and talk. doesn't matter what you say. And if you can feel the resonance with your hand right here, then you definitely have some amount of chest voice in your regular speaking voice. But let's say you're not sure. You might feel a, a smidgen there, but you've got this light, airy tone that it's, it's high-pitched, and you, you, you might not be sure if you're using any. You probably are. Right? I'm just going to say that right off the bat. And what you're doing is you are mixing a little bit of your chest voice in with a lot of, of head voice. Right? And so it'll end up sounding like this. Um, or it might. Sorry, I don't actually naturally have the voice, so I've got to kind of um, imitate it. But it, it's kind of like Michael Jackson, you know? How uh, in interviews and stuff, he would, he would speak like this. And... Um, it doesn't have a lot of chest resonance, but on the lower end of those um, notes-ish, I guess you could call them notes, on the lower end of that scale, you, you're you going to have a little bit of, of feeling right here. And what you can do to amplify that resonance is, I mean, obviously you drop lower, but if you have that tonality, it might not be easy to drop lower. So I've found that with everybody that I've helped out with this problem directly in person, um, is that if you can take a pure head voice note and then keep lowering it, lowering it, lowering it, it'll eventually flip into a pure chest note. Um, and it's a, uh, it's a relaxation thing, really. And so just take a, take a pure note. And then pure head voice note. And then lower it like this. Right? It'll just, at some point, your voice won't naturally go any lower in that register. And it'll just flip, just like that. Um, you can also just uh, swoop down. So, uh, uh, just clicks, right? And then take that note, uh, and then move around with it. Uh, maintain the relaxed position, and uh, that will get you some purity and uh, a little bit of power in your in your chest voice. So there you go. There you have it. Um, the quickest way and easiest way to get a pure chest note sound without straining or hurting your voice.